YouTubers, it's Ben here from Ben's Collectibles. Uh, managed to get the uh, other Rescue Bots figure off my boy. So I'm going to have a quick look at the Transformers Play School Hasbro da -de -da -de -da, Rescue Bots Chase. Um, as I said in the uh, Blades video, this is actually my son's favourite of the Rescue Bots. First of all, quick size comparison. Bring him prime. Uh, whoop. Um, it's a little bit too big. Uh, either that or prime's a little bit too small. I um, think he's pretty much exactly the same size as Bumblebee, and he isn't far off the same mould. Um, so, we look at him in uh, car mode first. If we can focus. There we go. It's nice, uh, nice detailing. Uh, good. Uh, Nice wheels. That not just a solid block. Uh, actually, um, cut those out, which is uh, which is nice. It's actually, actually probably the most detailed of all the uh, of all the rescue bots. Um, very very similar to the uh, to barricade from the Bayverse. Um, once again, like every single other. Rescue bot I have reviewed. The transformation is obviously simple as for children. With this one, you have the lights on the roof. Literally pull the lights back, and there we go. It's uh, yeah. These don't overly look like the characters from the animation. Um, I can only assume that's because these were these were made before the series was released. Again, like with blades, there's no face sculpt. It's uh, just a pair of goggles with some. Uh, I don't know if you can actually see. It's not overly well painted. It's a little bit of overlap there. Reminds me of the older T1000 from. Terminator 2, Judgment Day. Um, yeah, he's a he's a nice figure. Um, Sammy absolutely loves him. He's got uh, no articulation, spring-loaded arms, but that's <laughs> the head doesn't even move on this one. Um, let's have a look from the back view. He's a yeah, he's a, he's a good figure. Um, I think he's probably one of the uh, harder figures to get. Um, Chase being the <laughs> Chase figure of the set, if you like. Um, him and Boulder. Uh, we literally found him. Uh, my wife went to London for the day um, and saw him on the shelf and snapped him up, and we haven't seen him since. Um, yeah, anyway, we'll. Uh, Transforming back so I can show you just oh need to push it down because uh, I, was, I was definitely blinding about this uh, when we first bought it because I, I couldn't get it but if you actually have to push it right down to to lock it in um once again sorry this is such a quick review um he's uh, kicking up a bit of a stink because uh, he wants to toy back so <laughs> um Again, if you haven't already got this, go out and get it. Um, it completes the rescue bots, and it's. I think we paid. They were half price, but when we bought this thing, I think it was about twelve, thirteen pounds. And it's whatever that is, what about eighteen, nineteen dollars? But well worth a buy. Um, yeah, thanks guys. Uh, if you haven't already checked out my sister channel, it's the uh, or brother channel or whatever you want to call it. It's, it's the guys' hands of steel. Um, start up their own channel now, and they're. Uh, rapidly uh, firing off the reviews. Um, I think the link's down here somewhere in, in my favourite channels. Um, check that out and uh, I know that Roger's just done a really good review on the Doctor Wu I think the Battle Blades and the guns for uh, for the first edition uh, Optimus Prime from Transformers Prime although he's done it on the R.I.D. Prime and they do look awesome. Uh, yeah, check them out and don't forget to rate Subscribe and uh, comment. I'll try and respond to you all. Cheers, guys. See you later.